Good morning everybody, Robert here with BRPAutodesigns.com. Today's video happens to be on a little issue that I had a couple of weeks back. Now, if you recall, uh, a couple of weeks back I did a round trip, uh, I took a trip with a truck uh, pulling our uh, trailer. And uh, on the way back from our trip, we did a, a, about a thousand mile round trip from here to Texas and back and uh, on the way back I started having issues with my lockers my locker light started to flash down at the bottom and then my light the same thing on top it kind of went away for a bit then it came back um, and so um, what I did was at the time when it happened I was very concerned because I was towing a trailer and uh, I didn't want to have issues with it so what I did is I pulled over put it in neutral and try to disengage it but it just it, it wasn't doing anything um, at the same time the truck wasn't acting funny it, it felt fine it felt it was pulling fine it didn't feel like there was something wrong with it it was just the light so I figured it was pro possibly just a glitch well what I did was when I came back is I uh, took it down to the dealership and uh, explained to them what happened and they said that apparently it seems to be happening a lot so to a lot of JL owners and JT owners so if you have a JL or a gladiator um, I guess this is becoming a reoccurring issue and so um, dropped it off uh, a day later I get a call from the service advisor and he asked me if I could leave it there another day or two he said that he contacted Jeep and uh, or no Jeep contacted him after he put it in the system and they wanted him to run some more tests on the uh, the rear diff because apparently they're starting to have a lot a lot of issues with them so uh, they wanted to do a few more tests to see if that solved the problem I guess they were they were working on the problem trying to solve it and, my truck was the first one that they were going to be kind of using this new system to see if it would fix the problem. Well, it didn't fix the problem. So, what he told me that they told him was they're doing more research and there's po a possible recall coming. Possible recall. Um, the recall will consist of all the JLs and the, uh, and the JTs with the uh, locker option. And I guess the issue that they're saying, the problem is, it seems to be a solenoid in the rear lockers that's failing. And so uh, it could possibly lead to an accident or something bad if your rear locker was to lock or, you know, engage while you're out driving it normally. And so um, they're doing more research, uh, but there could be a possible recall on it which would be good on those vehicles that the warranty has expired. Like the JL, if you have a 2018, you might be close to having your warranty expire if it hasn't already. Um, and so that is a good thing uh, for those of you that if you didn't buy the extended warranty or anything else like that. So that being said, uh, once uh, they did the test and everything, he said, just bring it back in we ordered you a whole new rear diff, so they're gonna replace the entire rear diff. Um, <clears throat> I guess they, they found the solution, et cetera, et cetera. So right now I'm driving it there. They are gonna swap it out. It should take about, well, today I'm dropping it off. It should be done by tomorrow afternoon. So anyways, that being said, I'm on my way and you know, wish me luck. I hope everything goes good. I hope we don't have any issues, which I doubt. But uh, yeah, that's what's happening. Um, I'm on my way. Let's go drop it off. Okay, so check this out. We just picked up our Gladiator. We stopped at Circle K down here at the gas station gas up because we were on empty. Anyway, uh, let me show you what they did. They actually went ahead and re replaced the entire rear diff. They said it was actually easier to do that than to actually go in and um, replace the solenoid. Um, I asked them, I said, is is this an upgraded one? Did they fix the problem, et cetera, et cetera? They honestly couldn't give me an honest answer. They said, we don't know. Um, 
we don't know if they fixed it or not um, for all I know I got the same thing and it could fail again um, but like I said I won't know until I drive it and see how it performs um, other than that I mean heck it's under warranty um, they covered it I had no issues I did have to pay 85 bucks because they charged me for an hour of labor um, they said it was like they, they charged me half of what their labor rates are because they had to drill a couple holes you believe that shit but um, anyway um, we're ready to go I gassed up because I had no gas whatsoever but check this out on the process I was able to get one of these cool G boxes look at that I was in there and I was like look I said I see these boxes everywhere is there any way I could just uh, throw one in the truck and uh, take it home with me and they're like yeah go for it so that's my Jeep box I don't know what I'm gonna do with it yet I'm probably gonna stain it and uh, you know set it up for something or other some kind of cool display thing I don't know but anyway uh, I'm done here I just wanted to kind of share that with you uh, my lights off everything seems to be working good um, so only time will tell anyways um, I hope this video helps you guys here let me turn this around so you can actually see me so anyway let me hop on in here because it's pretty damn hot it's hundred and I think 115 today 110 I don't know it's hot so anyway let me switch this around and show you all of that stuff is gone no more flashing of my lockers no more <clears throat> no more issues whatsoever so um, I hope that the problem is fixed anyway uh, you know just want to give you guys an actual update of uh, the situation with the truck hopefully this video helps you guys out and I hope the problem is solved I'd hate to have the problem again and have to bring it back in and have them do it all over again um, I haven't had any problems whatsoever with it other than that so I love the truck uh, by any means I'm not thinking of getting rid of it I'm gonna keep it I love it um, but yeah just that that problem anyway if you guys like this video um, hit the thumbs up you know like follow us you know the drill anyways God bless you all and I will uh, talk to you guys soon bye everybody